what's up y'all welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel hey girl hey make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload a new video and if you're not already sis make sure you follow me on instagram at the hair life and the hair life official so today we're going to be getting into this frontal wig by love me hair thank you guys for sponsoring this video i'm just showing you guys everything that they sent in the box So here's the unit itself. I'm showing you guys the inside, the construction. It did come with an extra band as well as some combs and adjustable straps. And I did like that you do have the full four inches of parting space all throughout instead of just two on the sides. And I'm showing you guys up close on the knots. Um, Love Me's wigs usually bleach very well. I did bleach these with 30 volume developer for about an hour. And this is what they look like after. The hairline was nice already, but obviously it needed some extra customizing. So we're gonna do that. And I'm just showing you guys right here again, you can do a side part, a middle part girl, whichever you prefer. All right, y'all have seen me do my customizing before. We're not gonna do any baby hairs on this either so i'm just gonna go in with my hot comb and my tweezer and make this hairline look as natural as possible take my hot comb and wax stick and just slick everything back i want to make sure i cover up that last lift um so it won't be exposed and then i'm gonna do the same thing to the hairline just push everything back so you can see the natural hairline now that it's all customized and then i'm gonna go in with my baby lace curling iron and do some body curls So now onto the installation, I'm gonna take some alcohol and clean off my hairline. So now I'm just gonna take my foundation shade and I'm just gonna run that across the rest of that front part of my cap. And I'm gonna do the same exact thing to the actual lace of the front tool to tint it. And I did spray it with some hairspray um, to let it dry to make sure there was no transfer.
about you. So I quickly realized that this wig did not fit my head and I was not going to be able to do like any sideburn action. So as you guys can see, that track is over my ear with the lace. So I would have literally had to cut into the wig to be able to lay it down. Like the lace was completely covering my ears. It just didn't work out. And this typically happens with factory made frontal wigs which is why you guys do not see me review them often i'm a closure girl anyway but when i do frontals i prefer to just make them myself so i know it fits my head properly so even though it didn't fit i decided to just keep going just to show you guys but as you can see the lace is really really thin i'm just going in with some mousse and boho liquid gold mixed together um, since I knew I couldn't like keep this on for a long time, I just applied that to the lace and then I put on a melt band and let it dry. And that was pretty much it. Um, I'll post some pictures of the unit on my mannequin head as well. But if you're interested in like a frontal wig, an affordable frontal wig with good lace, then this is definitely a good one. It's just my measurements are kind of weird, so it didn't fit. So that was it for today's install, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any video requests down below. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I will catch y'all in my next one. Bye.